New tonight, a first of its kind championship basketball tournament is being held in Elk Grove. Yeah, the high school players, they've trained hard all season long to make tonight's finals, and they are not letting their physical and mental challenges get in the way of playing a good game. Hoop after hoop. These high school athletes are showing off their special abilities on the court. And I'm excited to do it. Ari Post, a 10th grader at Franklin High School in Elk Grove, is one of the fan favorites. Yeah! And I've been balling out my butt out there every single game. <laughs> the Unified Basketball League pairs more than 40 special education students with traditional high school athletes on co-ed teams. I give athletes that don't know how to dribble yet and we teach them and coach them and they get to a point where not only can they dribble but they're driving to the hole, they're laying it up and they're competing to win games. Laguna Creek coach Ryan Mills says it's important for kids with intellectual disabilities to have a chance to play in Friday night games just like any other high school athlete. We have so many students with all kinds of abilities levels that maybe don't get the opportunity to compete and this does give them that opportunity and the competition can be tough we've had one game where it was at the buzzer that we won another game we lost at the buzzer parents of players say there are no losers in these games he really enjoys it he's very athletic so he just likes to have fun being part of sports has always been difficult so this has been just an amazing opportunity this is the first year that the Elk Grove district has organized these unified games and they're trying to expand it to other schools and districts in the coming seasons we're just hoping that every year we just keep adding keep adding keep adding and then just it's going to be awesome Oh my gosh, don't you just love to see it? And in tonight's championship game, the Franklin Wildcats beat the Laguna Creek Cardinals to take home this year's winning title, but a big congrats all around.